Friday once again. So lick four zero seven, I think it is. But again, we're doing a John Mayer style lick this week, and one taken from Bold as Love, um, which is the Jimi Hendrix cover that he did off of the album Continuum. Which, if you haven't heard that album, and you're a guitar player, which you are because you're here. Um, then you need to listen to it because let's face it John Mayer's guitar playing is absolutely flipping amazing such great feel great licks really nice fluency along that fretboard so that's why we're doing this song so I may cover the whole solo soon as well once um, I've got to grips with playing it all in one go um, but for now we've got this lick coming up right now <laughs> So if you did like it, please do consider liking, sharing, subscribing, hitting the bell button for all the future notifications and visiting the social pages, TikTok, Instagram and Facebook. Don't worry about Twitter or X, whatever they've called it now. Yeah. Um, so basically it is a flavoursome lick which uses the A major scale and A major pentatonic um, and that's basically it. So you've got a few sixths in there as well as you run up the fretboard into that higher zone. Um, but there's not much more to it. It's just all about the flavor, the attack, the, the bends are really important in, in the sense of the way you bend them. Um, listen to both my version and um, obviously John Mayer's version and Hendrix's version because they are probably all slightly different in, in many ways. Um, but you know, just take out of it what you want to. You don't have to play the whole thing. You can just draw out that first lick is amazing all by itself. Um, and there's a couple of other things in there as well where you just think that would be a good lick you know just try and put that into your own playing so that's what we've got there it is coming up now is the breakdown the first lick of this is just a corker all by itself so the first few notes are amazing but the rest of it just together is just an absolute well it's a journey there you go You're taking you on a little journey up and down that fretboard so you're sliding in with your second finger into that sixth fret third string then you've got five second five first five second and then a full tone bend on the eighth fret second string another full tone bend from the seventh fret oh choked me up then didn't it um which uses basically the um uh, the a major scale so and that's going to be bending that seventh fret up a full tone back down to the seven on itself so that's the f sharp and then to the e twice okay so and then you're coming down to the major pentatonic and then bending that full tone fourth fret third and then it's two two on the third string and then the fourth fret on that fourth string so um then so you've gone Okay, so you're bending that up, um, going back down to that fourth fret, and then you've got a, a I hammer this on, but it's two hammer on to four for me um, on that third string. Two, two, second string, first string, five, two, and then I pull that off to the zero. Uh, to the two on the third string, four on the third, four on the fourth two on the third so that's that next lick so that goes back to there okay and then you'll slide in from the fourth fret to the sixth fret this is quite a fast chunk of the the, the lick and then you're skipping the, the b string to play the fifth fret on that first string so it's like uh, where, where are we like that coming into that and then you're sliding up to the ninth fret keeping the formation the same and then it's the eighth fret on the first string this time and then 11th fret on the third string slide into and then strikes of the 10 on that second string to finish it off now it's quite an erratic lick in many ways but obviously you can take from it 
whatever you want to. So just play around, see where you end up. It's a flipping awesome lick. There is not much more to say about it apart from that. Um, yeah, right, leave it at that. There you go, back to me. Nice one, we're at the end. So it's a great lick, one with full of flavor, full of fluency, and one that you can take from um, micro licks as you sort of go through it and just think, well, that one's quite nice. I might steal that for my own playing, which you should do, you know? That's what us guitar players do, it's a bit of plagiarism along the way. So when you've done your plagiarizing thing, um, just make sure you subscribe to this channel and um, like all the uh, social stuff as well. It's just fun, isn't it, you know? Anyway, I'm not gonna ramble on because I've done it too much already. So let's see you next week for week 408, I think it is. Could be wrong, but anyway, see you next week. Later, everyone.